We turn now to what appears to be a deadly shark attack in Maine. Witnesses say something grabbed a woman swimming just offshore. This morning, tragedy off the coast of Maine, where a woman has died after an apparent shark attack. Witnesses tell reporters on the scene that the woman's body was flung into the air by something in the water. It appears the female may have been attacked by some sort of animal. Police say two kayakers helped the victim get to shore, but she was pronounced dead at the scene. Outside New York City around the same time, two shark sightings forced the closure of several beaches on Long Island. Came out, shot out of the water, spun around, just didn't look like a dolphin. Fin, definitely a shark. Lifeguards who saw one of the sharks say it was a bull shark, an aggressive species that can grow up to eight feet long. Authorities later released a photo of a sea ray that washed up nearby with enormous bite marks. This was a sizable one. Uh, and it can do some damage in the wrong situation, and it's a credit to the lifeguards working together with all these agencies to protect the residents. Experts say shark attacks are down this year as more people stay home due to the pandemic. But last month in North Carolina, a 16-year-old suffered 40 puncture wounds after fighting off a shark. I tried lifting my leg up out of the water, and I saw, oh my God, it's a five-foot-long shark attached to my leg. There's a shark. Look at that, everybody. There's a shark I in front of everybody. And this family's recent close encounter in the northern Atlantic off the coast of Nova Scotia, a great white shark swimming right beside the speedboat. That's a great white. Oh, it's a great white. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Yeah. Authorities have not released the identity of that victim in Maine. If confirmed, it would be the first fatal shark attack on record in that state. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.